This is inverted vitrectomy, ILM folding technique for large macular holes. These are the pre-op OCTs and FA. The macular hole measures 844 microns as measured by OCT. It is a large stage 4. The hyaloid is already detached. That's a regular vitrectomy, not inverted, with an air fluid exchange. We now use a wide-angle lens. That's inverted vitrectomy. We are using a macular lens with a great visualization. After brilliant blue, you actually have a very good view from the ILM. We open up a tear in the ILM, a vertical one. We start the peel in a rexis-like movement, counterclockwise, lifting the internal limiting membrane and relieving all tractions around the macular hole. We complete the peel, leaving a great part of the ILM intact, as you see. It's very important to get the most of the membrane. We, we now use the closed tip of the ILM forceps to actually move the ILM into the hole in a very slow and gentle fashion. We go downstream from nasal to temporal towards the hole. Since the hole is a large one, the tip will fit in without a problem. You see now the membrane rolled over itself in a tubular fashion that makes it easier to enter the hole. We proceed now another AFX, air fluid exchange. Postoperative period number 7 shows very clear media and a clear lens and a closing hole with the edges approaching. Thanks.